The developers at DCCEX last night, August 7th, announced the new version 5.0 of their command station. This is a game changer, and let me show you why. Here are some of the new features on there, and I'll show you what's on GitHub. The DCC EX team is pleased to release Command Station EX version 5.0.0 as a production release for the general public. This is a major new release, including some breaking changes as well as major new features. Let's go over some of these new features, fixes, and enhancements. New Track Manager run both dc and dcc from the same controller this controller right here you could run your dc layout along with dcc using your cell phone as a throttle so all you dc people pay attention beta support for new 32-bit microcontrollers including esp32 room and some st microtronics nucleo boards extensive optimization of high mem usage to free up program mem below 64k byte and increase the useful life of avr mega 2560 platform an option to disable programming to allow limited platforms such as arduino uno to run limited xrel scripts add support to our new fast clock ex fast clock add support to the new io expander ex io expander add support to our new turntable controller x turntable add support to duino nodes Add support to rotary encoders, which is a really good option. Add support for PCF8775 and PCA TCA9555 GPIO devices, which you could add more inputs and outputs on your Mega, which you could you have 40 already, and you could even add even more. Enhanced over current detection, including enhancing the behavior and deal with in rush current issues moves startup of the hell earlier in the boot sequence improved performance of adc analog to digital reads enhance the i squared c bus retries and timeout support for i squared c multiplexers to help with devices and it goes on and on and on and another good thing is in here that you will be able to use df player mini which Put sound in there, and you can also use the PCA9685 to run your lights for special effects on there, and a lot of other good things with the I Square C devices, where you could have your little devices to show text. So, a lot of good things on here. I'll have more on this in the future. I don't have time to do anything on it right now. I'm in the middle of a couple of uh, builds and giveaways and working on this over here. I have a backlog of videos to do, but as soon as I get time, I'm going to be installing version 5 on here and testing it out see, and see what we can do with this. So until the next time, we'll see you and have fun with whatever you're doing.